lot of change, been through a lot of pain. Some things are not the same as they were a year ago. But all will be okay. I move on each and every day. The past is where it stays, way back a year ago. I've changed for the better this time. I thought I would never be fine. I strive just to say I'm alright. And for the first time in a long time, I'm alright. I've seen a lot of change, been through a lot of pain. Some things are not the same as they were a year ago. But all will be okay. I move on each and every day. The past is where it stays. Way back a year ago. back ladies and gentlemen that sun's on it though I can't really get it that is a massive tree there so here we are back in Centralia Pennsylvania wasn't going to put this video out but other explorers have already done it so I might as well before they destroy it I'm not quite hiding behind a tree here well yes another one is going to go down for the wrecking ball soon fire hydrant is now out of service here So I'm going to do an outside walk around tour because I'm not going in. I don't do the trespassing thing. This property is one of the last ones. And we're going to take an outside look at it today. Smell something dead in the area. An animal of some sort probably. But this was a beautiful home for many, many of years. Sad to see it go. Well kept up. There is. Did you see over there yet? Vent boreholes everywhere around the property. Power has been cut off. So we're going to do an outside walk. Nice manicured lawn here at the same time still. So it's, like I said, they just moved out. Power's been cut, as you see. Two-story with a basement. It was a very nice looking property. Like I said, there's the vents are everywhere. Four holes. But, yes, sealed off real nice and tight. Can you imagine having this in your backyard? Nobody around you? I guess it's beautiful. But, like I said, everywhere in the yard, I have those. Like, they're everywhere. And the bees' nest is building up there in the corner. Maybe wolf. Beautiful tree. There it is. Yeah, it looks like it was really well kept up with. Let's see what else. 
else we got? I only tried to break the door down yet, I'm surprised. Yeah. I can't get over how big and massive that tree is, how beautiful that looks. Might have got that good shot of that. Not positive, ladies and gentlemen. Well, like I said, we coming around to the front again. Had a nice concrete driveway. I was like, this is something you'd see nowadays that people live in. Something we would build nowadays. I mean, can you just imagine? This is your own, you got your own neighborhood. Like a whole two city blocks to yourself. That would have been beautiful living out here. All the wildlife coming up. Let's go over here and take a look at what this is. So obviously, it's a burn barrel. Burning the trash and everything up there, you know. Why not, right? But, like I said, just to give you an idea, there's absolutely nothing around you. Wow, that's a big hole down there, actually. Absolutely nothing around you. So I just want to really document the place before the looters, the squatters, and the ignorant folks get in here and start destroying it. How nice and preserved this was and taken care of. Like I said, before everybody gets in here and starts vandalizing and destroying it, the beauty of Centralia in its final days. So it was really nice kept up with, it has a real nice roof on it still. And yes, I did check the door, it is locked. I just wish they would have boarded up over the doors. I'd have been a lot happier with that because I know they're going to get in this building and they're going to destroy it, destroy it all. A lot of wolves, little yellow jacket wolves flying around. But yeah, I'm going to go check out some of these vent pipes. Let's go check them out. Before we move on any farther, I just want to show you again, even up in the Corner up there, I don't know if I can get that to work right there. Right up in a dead corner there is a wolf's nest as well. And all the way down this eave, down this, a bunch of them building down there. You see down by that gutter and above that door there, which is awesome. I like the idea of them being around the door. It's like added on security, you know. We're gonna, like I said, I wanna get an up close look at one of these before we leave. Look how beautiful it is out here. Yeah, four holes, monitor the mine fire, which came from that direction actually. Wow, like I say, can you imagine having this in your backyard here? There's something in the distance there. I don't know what that is. I'll go check that out. Oh, this is beautiful. Beautiful out here right now. Beautiful weather. I'm gonna miss this place. State finally won. and gentlemen found some feathers laying around wonder what these are if you know in the comments please let me know because I'm actually clueless well I believe that's going to conclude our tour of this I'm sure some other youtubers are gonna come here and 
vandalize and be disrespectful to our hometown and destroy it. But one last time. One of the last houses in Centralia to go. Well, till next time, ladies and gentlemen. Rise above, crack on. Please like and subscribe if you haven't. Last street light on this block. I almost forgot about that. It's one of the newer ones too, you see how it's LED. Well, that's it, ladies and gentlemen. We're out of here. Have a good day. Hear about your extended car warranty? Guess nobody's home. Welcome to my backyard. Come on back. This here is going to turn into a forest. It's going to be beautiful. Show all you folks if you want to spin around behind me here, ladies and gentlemen. I even took the steps off the house. I still think people are going to break in regardless. Start from the back here. Well, let's hope not. I hope you viewers have enough respect if you come here. Leave it as it is. The way I am when I come, I do my explore, look at it. If you don't go in, you leave it alone. Don't vandalize it. Don't spray paint it. Show some respect for the history here. Show some respect for the people that lived here. That didn't want to lose their house. That stuck it out after all these years of living around all this. Granted, yes, it turned into a beautiful place to live. But they had to give this up because the state. Come on now. Show a little respect for the history of Centralia. Leave this one alone. Thank you.